Even Hammond was looking on the bright side. It weighs just over a thousand kilos. Well, a Lotus Elise weighs just under a thousand kilos, so it's a Lotus Elise. Despite our enthusiasm, though, we still hadn't overtaken anyone. Oh, I've lost the power steering. And the 75 was starting to suffer from alpharitis. When you put your arm on the centre console, your elbow does operate the rear windows. That is an issue. But it still has that alpha magic that you can't ever really describe. Only Alfa Romeo owners know. What was that? No. Something's horribly wrong here. There's a buzz, there's a feel that's different and odd. I had to make a pit stop. This is the thing you have to remember, is Alpha build a car to be as good as a car can be, briefly. That left it up to my colleagues to defend Alpha's reputation. <laughs> Squeeze the power through the long banked curve. My flywheel bearing sounded very poorly. It's an incredibly um, complex job to put a new one in. It's now quarter to 11 in the morning. I might be able to get a new one in, if I had one, by about, um, by about October. I therefore decided to cool it down with a fire extinguisher. It was a brilliant idea. But then I got some bad news over the radio. Um, I've just been told something rather interesting. What's interesting? While you're sitting in the pit, every car that passes the pit lane wall counts as an overtake. Oh, for God's sake. Can we hang out with that jack? More to the point, Jez, are you being overtaken by me consistently? Just overtaking you again, Jeremy. Shut up, Hammond. My flywheel was the first real problem of the day, but soon they were coming thick and fast. Clutch. I'm going to the floor. The brakes are just cooked. I think I'll just rest here, let my brakes cool for a bit. My brakes are shot. Just is shot on the dip smelling and the flywheel. Bad. The driver's seat here has collapsed on the right-hand side. Is that water pump gasket failure or some sort of the pump? The actual pump. Then I tried to get a point by overtaking Captain Slow. Naturally, that got us black flag, but at least I took full responsibility. You That's turned in on me. No That's you know where you're said? supposed to turn. On top of all this, the overtaking challenge was descending into a farce. Oops. As a 16-year-old boy's just overtaken me in a Corsa. I'm going to take a Gallardo Super Leggera. Yes! That's a joy. Oh, wait, now he's gone again. Soon, though, my disappointment got worse. That's not good. What's happened? Jeremy's exhaust appears to have fallen off. <laughs> that got me black flagged again. Cow. It's nothing to worry about. It's just the exhaust. It's alphas. They do things that you're just not ready for. A point that was proved moments later. What's the matter? Clutch. Well, get it back up. Otherwise, the producers will laugh at us. I know. Come on. I can hardly believe this. The only car that is out there right now working is Hammond's. Well, when I say working... Please give me another cylinder back. Please change your mind back and be a four-cylinder again. As we sorted out our little niggles, the tally continued to mount. But even Jeremy was admitting speed isn't everything. Been but those Caterhams and Porsches, I can think, I just say, yeah. they're fast. Yeah, brisk. Do they have the soul, the well, character, the, the passion? If Catherine Ross 
she of Butch Cassidy and the Sundance Kid fame and the graduate were to come here and choose her favourite car. It would be one of them. None of them. Finally, we were ready to get back out there. And this time, we had a plan. By working together, we'd stop the overtaking massacre. Get, get alongside me, quick as you can. Yeah, now let's see them overtake. <laughs> Brilliant! Why didn't we think of this before? <laughs> Have you been overtaken recently? No, no, for a while, actually. No, neither have I. Of course, to stop anyone sneaking by on the wider bits of the track, we had to weave about a bit. Oh, that's not gone well. Overall, though, my tactic was working brilliantly until I was stabbed in the back. That's the point for me. Oi. <laughs> They've ruined the game now, look. Backstabber Hammond was now getting very cocky. <laughs> he fell off! Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, I've got no engine. Brutus Hammond was out with a broken water pump, and then it was the turn of Cassius May. No! Clutch! Meanwhile, for me, things were looking good. Hey, it looks like we got ourselves a slow coach here. I'm going to take the focus. Come on! Come on, Alpha! Show the world! Yeah, youth! How do you feel now? I've got a point! Oh, my God, the brakes. <laughs> Whoa. What's wrong with yours? All the water's coming out. Is it? It's not good. <clears throat> How's Jeremy doing? That's the thing. I don't know. Ask him, actually. Jeremy, how are you doing? Not brilliantly. I think it's going to be all right. Just need a tow truck. <laughs> Do you think they're A, going to be sympathetic, or B, be a nice couple of... Work. No, they're going to be a couple of. I'll tell you what happened. I'll tell you what happened. No, a it's man came, he flip. pushed it over when I wasn't looking. No, you crashed it and it's on its side. I didn't really? crash it. No, look what you've done, man! A... Yeah! <laughs> look what you've done! It's a minor scuff. Come on, car, don't let me down. Oh. Doesn't sound good, that car. 